Sung here with another tutorial. This time we are taking a look at a request that came from one of my subs, eFuzzyBoots. And what Fuzzy Boots wants to know is how can we create a YouTube intro? And so when I was thinking about that, I thought there were at least two ways that I would go about doing it. The first one had to do with what you're seeing here, creating a YouTube intro in PowerPoint. And the reason why I thought of that was not everybody necessarily is going to have uh, Photoshop or some other kind of graphic design program. And I thought maybe well, one of the office suites. And I know that I've done little, I guess, announcement videos and those kinds of things uh, in PowerPoint and thought this could be a perfect way to do that. So here we go. Here are the things that you're going to need um, to get the intro going with PowerPoint. First, you're going to need PowerPoint. Then you're going to need a background. It could be a picture or a video. Today we're going to be using a video. Then you're going to need a logo if you have one. And text, which obviously can be very easily generated within PowerPoint. So that's what we're going to need here. Okay, so what I've done here is actually created a little bit of an intro video for my um, church site. Uh, we do videos on there and, and such and so I was messing around with this and so what we're going to try and do is actually duplicate this. You can see we've got two different slides and you can also see that this is in a widescreen format which is not the default for PowerPoint. So let's go ahead and get started with a new file. So you can see here that we've got a standard 4x3 frame so we're going to come up to design and we're going to go to page setup and we're going to change this with this drop down box to 16 by 9 and we're going to go ahead and OK. So now we need our background. Now I've pre-selected these and put them in a folder. Excuse me. We come over here to insert and then video. We're going to go ahead and pick this video background that I picked out with our we've got a service that we pay for annually it's actually very reasonable it's about a hundred dollars a year for uh, graphics and video loops and such um, but I went ahead and placed this in here now I want to insert my logo and I want to go ahead and resize it now unfortunately it's probably not going to be exactly perfect to my other one but that's okay. And then I'm just going to go back and forth between the two so I can pick up some of these texts so I don't spend the time duplicating that. But you can see here I went ahead and got that placed in there. Now Control M get you a new slide or you can go ahead and just hit a duplicate. And since we're going to be using the same background we'll go ahead and do that. I'm not using that now so I can go ahead and use this. And if I hold down the Control key if you didn't already know this you can see there's a little plus sign that shows up next to the cursor and I can left click and drag and it will make a copy. Um, but for the sake of time I'm going to go ahead and just delete these guys out here and grab them from the other because the really important stuff are the settings. And that's what we're going to look at next time as we look at how to create a YouTube intro through PowerPoint.